So, you know, when people do shows, usually they're concerned about the day of the show, how they're gonna look, <laughs> meticulous calculating their tanning, their sleep. Yo, I'm over here on Yelp doing work, I planning out, He's planning F out what meals we are having. And I made a list, I've been asking people, and it's going down like this. So post show, we have sushi at Doraku. Doraku? Yeah. Looks amazing. Then the next morning, I want a macadamia sticky bun from the Marriott Hotel. Just one, I don't want to overdo it because we're gonna shoot. We might actually end up going up to the acai bowl place at Diamond Head Health Bar. Um, and then I want to do pokey at Ono, and I want to get a masala, ma, masaladas, I don't know how to say it, it's like a fried donut thing Ooh. at Leonard's Bakery. I heard they're the, the, the best thing. And then pancakes, either at Yogurt Story, or Boots and Chemos. <laughs> yes. Boots and Hose. But we forgot. <laughs> it's Boots and Hose. Boats? She said Boots and Hose. <laughs> She, 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 hangs, she, hangs, she hangs out with me, thinks she can quote movies and quotes them wrong. Hey, Spoiler, you forgot dessert on post show night. You can't just hit one place. You like post Yo, if, if that Leonard spot's open post show night, I'm, yeah. hitting that, I'm hitting that donut spot post show night. But that sushi looks amazing. And another one, I got a donut shop. What'd you got? It's Cam, Cam's Bakery. Cam. K-A-M. It's got some long Hawaiian name, but really? I don't know. But I have it marked as well. Cause I've had, uh, yeah, I've had, I've had a lot of people talk to me about this Leonard. It's like it's a staple. It has like four thousand reviews and five stars. Hey, you get more than one. That's true. Purpose of today's workout: Thursday, on stage Saturday. I got a 40 minute ish circuit training. So I'm gonna pick one exercise for each body part, do something like pull ups, bench press, triceps, biceps, quads, hamstring, just light reps, about 50 to 60% of normal. Get a good pump. Don't wanna have like, you know, get, get to where I'm feeling like I can have a real good pump and then back off a little bit. The reason we're doing this, making sure we're getting those carbs into the cell. Also, don't want to overextend yourself, don't want to get too sore, don't want to deplete glycogen here. You know, we're still trying to force some of those carbs in there. Also, just getting in some work, so if you lay around too much, you get a little watery. So getting in some work, again though, we're about 50 to 60% of normal. We've been training 80% of normal all week. So first uh, circuit day on a Thursday. Tomorrow, we'll go a light 20 minute circuit. Wake up Saturday, do a little bit of posing in the morning, and it's showtime. I'm using, got my beats in. Kids always ask me what kind of headphones I got. What's important though, is what I'm listening to. And it's my Gymshark Steve Cook Spotify playlist. It's so fire.
gonna quickly introduce, so we got the YouTube here. We got Kenny, my, my posing today, I wanted to make sure it was spot on, so who do I call? This man right here, Kenny is, he's the man. So uh, thank you so much, appreciate you buddy. Just got done at the gym, how are you feeling? Tired, I'm hungry. She said I didn't want to be on the camera, but with YouTube, it chooses the time you don't choose, you don't choose, YouTube chooses. And since we're rolling back to the hotel post-workout, we're both tired, we're hungry. Courtney had a baby brother. Can I tell people that? Sure, Courtney's, you just did. Courtney's dad um, and her stepmom had a new baby brother and we're seeing pictures, so cute. The only problem is she has a 150 pound Rottweiler mm -hmm. that looks like it wants to eat the baby in the pictures we're looking at. I should show you the pictures. Well, so do you know what this also means? We're gonna need to plan a trip to Chicago to go meet babysit. your baby brother. Yo, that is a 150 pound Rottweiler look at looking baby, at that baby like it's lunch. And then look at, look at my little brother. That's Max. so crazy. Is that weird to say? And the dog's name is Rex. Rex and Max. Seriously, they sound like two dog names. I know, Re don't say that, what if they watch? So, oh that's true, sorry guys, but it does still <laughs> sound like that, leave it in. Um, Indominus Rex is what I call him, because he's like the dinosaur off Jurassic Park, he's just a mean son of he's a gun. He's huge. What do you, uh, how are you feeling for the show? I'm ready. Do you just like doing a show in a setting like this more than you like doing it in like Ohio? Just being honest. Yes. Because it's like fun and you can go walk around. You can and eat your meals outside looking over Waikiki. Mm -hmm. I said beautiful. earlier today, I will never ever do a show. If I ever do a show again, it will always be in a tropical location because where do you want to mm -hmm. take, where do you want to look your best? On the beach taking tropical pictures. We haven't taken a tropical picture yet. We well, just took one by, with flowers behind that's us. That's true. Yeah, well, we're going to take true. some good ones. We got to go to the beach and take some pictures. Great. In our hotel, they have a market, I guess, every Thursday. Bread, donuts, malasadas, and I'm just, the smells are enough to make me want to start crying right now. But two more days and I'm about to go ham up in this piece. Dollar bill. Are you hijacking my video no. right now? <laughs> Sorry. Thank you. I love it. We're here in this market and they got they got food galore, like fried everything. Courtney, what are you getting? Better watch out. The only thing girl. that's making her excited, cucumbers and celery. She's so excited about it. And she made a deal that she didn't she didn't want the ranch or the tomatoes. She just wanted the cucumbers and celery. Yo, I'm not mad about a Waikiki sunset. Waikiki, you know, life doesn't get much better than this. <laughs> Unless you have an Australian accent, and then it gets better. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. That's all he gets here for. Sun is setting on our first full day here in Honolulu, Waikiki. Such an amazing time already we've had here from the people. I think as pretty as this all is, and it is very, very gorgeous. The people so far we've met, at the gym, the hotel, everyone's so great. So that aloha spirit, I guess you could call it. Um, I recommend Hawaii, honestly. Hawaii might be my favorite. It's just magical here. So we got a crazy uh, day tomorrow getting tanned. Today was kind of a down day for us, a down day tomorrow. Tanning, athletes meetings, Saturday, get on stage, chow down after the show. Hopefully the sushi spot will be open. If not, we'll get burgers. That is pretty much it. 